so you, you kind of just talked about brotherhood and uh, uh, when it comes to our team last year, we still have a group chat together where we send like funny videos and whatnot with each other. And you share with us a funny moment when you, uh, you played, I think you posted too, you played Matt Anderson. I think you either tooled him uh, one play and then you just got in his face and then like, didn't he like stuff you the next play or something like that? <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, well, yeah, what happened was, um, I mean, I got to go in, in Modena, which is an amazing place to play, and it, it was sold out. And that's, I mean, I love those situations. And you, you live all your life to play against Matt Anderson, Michael Christensen, all, all those guys. So, and we were losing pretty hard. So, and I, and I kind of hate it, like the way, not hate it, but our team kind of lacked a lot, lot of balls or energy mm-hmm. a little bit. So I came in and just, I was just like, okay, if, I, if I'm going to get a kill, I'm going to talk a little shit. So yeah. I, I think I, really hit, I didn't really tool him. But I hit it high off his hands out, <laughs> and then I kind of, I kind of stared him down and, and laughed because I think it was, it was the first point. It was the first. No, I didn't. I should have. Oh, the first point of the set. The so like, and I just came in. So Michael Christensen was like, "Okay, this is fine. Like, he's gonna do this to, to Matt." And then I was like, "Matt, I'm gonna work your fingers all night." <laughs> off his hands. So I was like, and then I Rock stopped, the and I was like, "I told him like, I told you, I told you." That's what he yelled to the net. It's like I told you. And then the next play, obviously Micah sets him right back. And Matt, as experienced and amazing volleyball player as he is, which is like he didn't bounce it off me. He didn't go to me, but he did even something more humiliating. I thought he, he just like I, I went over. I thought I pressed, like I, I jumped as high as possible. I jumped over and he just like slow roll shot it like right like in my chest. <laughs> oh, like, God. And it was as slow as well as possible. And I think I mean, the tools, that's always, like, but that's just, like, he knew exactly where I was, was going to go. I was going to go high, possible, and he just, like, slow rolled it, like, right under me. And I think he, he stared me down, too. But I yeah. turned quickly. Yo, so, yo, at UH, too, there's a lot, I think, uh, for some reason, Hawaii gets in a lot of matches where there's a lot of stuff that goes through the net. What, what, what do you recall the program or the team and year that talked the most trash to us through the net? I know Ooh. who I uh, I mean, I know, I know, I think I know what the team, what, it, what you're meeting, but I think the first time I got actually, because in Europe, it's not really as common to talk trash. Yeah. Like, I never really learned that. It's even mm. in Europe, in soccer, it's just you just like kick, respect kick somebody yeah. or like, the no, American you just elbow, thing, yeah. elbow, like you go physical more or anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's more of an American thing to talk funny because there's a difference as, as, as cussing at someone that's yeah. more the European way or in like being in your face. But I think it was the first time I got introduced to it was Michael Seda at UCLA. <laughs> and we were in blocking lines. And you're in blocking lines. And I was just jumping up as a freshman. And he goes, swipe. Swipe the whole time. Every time I jumped, he goes, swipe. Cool. Swipe. And I was like, who is this guy? But I, I, I loved it. But then I think, I mean, CSUN was always, like, talking a lot. Like, no matter what they the score. Had some, no matter what score. We would be them or they would always. Be but our senior was, year, yeah, we were smacking them, and they were talking to them. And they're like, still talking. I know you got it, <laughs> but um, and who else? Let me think. There was one play. I I brought this up the other day with somebody. So we were playing Lewis my junior year, and my and Jordan Ewart, who's one of our good friends, his roommate this year, Moses, I think. My love. Julian, oh, Julian Moses, yeah. He goes out one on one with me. He goes up. It was set point for us, and he bounces the ball two feet out of bounds over past me and he hits it out and he stared at me he didn't realize he hit it out he stared at me like shaking his head and i just I'm like, I'm like dude look the ref called it out and, <laughs> hey, you can't call him out I mean, you're on the show joe you have a you have a big audience we decided no, to kind of go with no, I, I, it's ours the way we think of it it's no, our not show out. He's, he's, he's a funny guy i know he's a cool guy no yeah. no 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 I mean, there's a, I, I think I recall a funny, the, the one thing I like to do is that when a player has a tough time or like he's their guy. Yeah. And you I talk remember, trash on our team. Yeah. Time. I remember, I remember, I think it was Sif on um on uh, UCSD yeah, yeah, yeah. and we were, we were kind of smacking them. And then I think I blocked him and I was like, like you gotta set him more. Like you have like, five kills. <laughs> like you gotta set him more. Like what is he that. doing? He's over an African. Like <laughs> one kill tonight. Like you gotta set him more. Why are you going away from? Him? Are you afraid? Like that. I like I like doing that kind of stuff. Or or this. I, no, I, you were I, good I, at you were good at trash so talking. You, you were good. So you never had Your English is obviously very very good, and you've got you got really good at trash talking. You did the most on our team for sure. It was good though. It was I, I, during the game. I did. I did. Yeah. And it was also hey, there was one more against BYU. We did a, that game when oh, we beat yeah. them. That was a lot of trash talking. I remember just I was just yelling as soon as it's set point. Like I remember it was 
it was 24. We had match point, and I yelled through the net, "That's ball game!" And then you said the next. <laughs> I remember. I remember at BYU. I, I usually I don't talk as much trash, but the biggest thing is I was so hyped up for that game. I remember it was like at towards the end, of the end. I remember they were challenging, and I went to the crowd. And I was like, "Exits that way!" Exits, <laughs> and I just went to student section. I was like. Yeah, and then like an old guy was like yelling at me. I just kind of waved back at him. I, I probably shouldn't open my mouth that much, but I think Hawaii is a unique place because we have so many different cultures and so many different languages. People are swearing and talking trash in like six different languages all the time. So you like hear like after like a play, yeah. like you're hearing all this like crazy. Like I mean, I think we had like four different, five different languages at once yeah. on the court this year. Yeah. And I was like, Rado always would say some stuff, but not in English. But <laughs> yeah. I, I would always wanted them to hear want want them to hear it, you know. Yeah, it, for sure. Um, I mean, I think I think if it's if it's witty and funny, I think it's okay. I, I wouldn't cuss someone out, but I, if it, if it's witty mm-hmm. and funny, I would. No, nope. I would always. Just, yeah, like if you hear like if you hear uh, you hear it most when like they mess up. So you learn like so many swear words in so many yeah. different languages because like just, it, like, just people are the like Eastern Europeans a lot. They and they admit this too. Like I play with a lot of Eastern Europeans now. They use they have the worst swear words ever. Some of the stuff they no, say, they yeah. tell me in it's translation. So horrible. I'm like, in translation is the, bad. the translation no, is yeah. so horrible. Yeah. Horrible stuff. But the, um, I mean, I, I now like I was recently watching a video of Hawaii like this year, and I would always also during the game, like during the play, I would always say if I like kind of blocked someone, but the ball came back to him. I would always yell this at him, set him again, set him again. Set him. <laughs> and then this year, I heard, I heard on TV, Rado X2 was like, set him again, give him the ball. Come to me. <laughs> I mean, I like doing that stuff. That's you know? or, or, yeah. Hell yeah, Rado. Hell yeah. Yeah, Rado definitely jogged a little more this year. But the, I mean, when you're the, like the big, big guy, I mean, you got it. I love yeah. it. I'm all about it. If you back it up with your play, that's the, that's the worst thing when they, when they suck. And then they, they <laughs> they talk, like, like, I'm like, yeah. bro, shut up. Worry about your game, man. You're trash right now. Yo, so 